All right, we're going to take a closer look at the Anarchist. Is that how you say it? Anarchist X tugboat competition cap. Okay, competition cap. All right. Comes in a little baggy like this. A little Ziploc baggy. Not actual Ziploc, but it's a zippy baggy. All right. And here's what you get. All right, it's got the tugboat logo, logo right there. Hashtag tug life on the top, on the drip mouthpiece, whatever. It's got six staggered air holes or airflow holes in there. On the other side, you've got the Anarchist logo. It's pretty sweet. And of course, on the opposite side, you've got those six staggering hose. So it looks a lot like the, uh, what is it, the Mutation X type of airflow. And I think I've seen another cap out there that's got airflow kind of like this one. It is not adjustable. Here's what the inside looks like. This is stainless steel. That is all one piece right there so the drip tip or nothing comes off of it the top cap no, nothing comes off of it. it's all one solid piece all right now on the website from the place i got it from says that this is made for the version 2 the uh, tugboat v2 like this right here and of course never mind my build don't look at my build folks it's probably ugly anyway it will fit on the V2s, it's like that. Nice and snug and everything. But that wasn't the reason I bought mine. I'll get that out of the way. It also fits on the version ones. Take that cap off of there. Got a couple of verticals in there. And I would line it up right over that vertical like that. And boom. Look at there. It ain't just for the V1 or the V2s, it's for the V1s also. And that's how I've been rocking mine. I've been putting mine on my version 1 to give it more airflow because the version 1's holes ain't quite like the version 2's. So, uh, that's it on the uh, up close part of the uh, Anarchist competition cap for your tugboat. How does this daggum competition cap vape? Let's take a look at that. See it? There it is. Step back a little further. She's a blowin', she's a junk, and she's doing all that good shit. All right, up next in the zoom diggity mode here, we got the Anarchist drip tips. Now they come in a little baggy. Oh, don't stick to the clock. Come in a little baggy like this with a sticker. Oh, gotta love stickers. Pretty sweet looking sticker too. Anywho, that's what it comes in. Now I've gotten two of these. I couldn't make up my mind whether I wanted the black one or the, the stainless one, so I got them both. Oh, hurt my wallet, but dadgummit. Anywho, here they are. This is what they look like. This is the stainless steel. My fingerprints. I'm gonna get a little bit closer look there. There's the logo on that one side. Now if you'll notice something about these, they're very, very similar. Actually, they're exactly the same as a tugboat drip tip. The short stubby, I think is what they call her, the shorty. So that's it right next to a tugboat drip tip. All right. So that's the stainless steel one. And this one is the black anodized aluminum. Yep. As you can see, let me pull my cap out for the version 1. It fits perfect on the tugboats. Nice and snug, no wiggling. 
Because if anything, in my opinion, they're the exact same design as the tugboat drip tip. I mean, I'll stick it in the middle and y'all tell me what you think. Ah, get up here. No, no, no. All right. I mean, look at there. Exact same design. I believe they did a collab here anyway, but that's what they look at. Look like. Anywho, there are the anarchist drip tips. Well, I reckon y'all would want to see what the bore is like in there. It's got pretty decent bore. I think it is actually considered to be wide bore, but it does bevel down into the bottom. So there's not like a, a flat step in there. It bevels down. Can't see the black very well, but just like the tugboat ones. There you go. There's the bottom. Booyah. <laughs>